Buenos dias, compañeras y compañeros. Buenos dias, Madrid. Dear friends, I can feel your vibe, the vibe and energy of a strong campaign with a strong commitment for victory for the progressives in Europe. I would like to start by thanking Pedro Sanchez, not only for the warm hospitality, which we all enjoy here in Spain, but mostly for what he is doing for Spain and for Europe in the last year. He took a risk to pull up Spain and the people of Spain out of desperation and give perspective and hope and recreate optimism. This is what our family is about. It's about optimism giving better future. And that is what we shall be talking about today. We are very concerned by the Partido Popular in Spain and Ciudadanos for what they do, for what they do, because they are ready for an unholy marriage with the devil. They are whitening the extreme right in Spain. We deeply believed that your country is somehow protected against this virus, against extreme nationalism. But we see that the right wing is recreating them, giving them credibility and legitimacy. And this is not acceptable for all progressives. Am I right? Last night, our leaders, thanks to the hospitality of Pedro, had the chance to see a great piece of art, which is speaking to the whole world, Guernica by Pablo Picasso. And we were standing there in front of this wonderful painting, hypnotized, but also terrified by the pain, by the yelling of human victims of a war. This is a warning to the whole world and to Europe, what we have and what can be lost. And we shall never forget the words of the great French president and the great socialist Francois Mitterrand, who said, once upon a time, nationalism is war. It may sound too strong, maybe, but this is a real threat. And you know, we are people from all over Europe here today, speaking different languages. But there is one Spanish phrase which every socialist, every progressive knows by heart. These are the words. No pasarán. No pasarán. We know that these elections will be, as France is saying, for the soul of Europe, which is so precious. And we know our mission, our responsibility. We shall not stand back to nationalism. And we shall not bow to the alliance of the EPP of the traditional right with the nationalists. Because I can tell you as a historian, this is not an opinion, this is a historical fact. Extreme right comes to power when the traditional right is taking their rhetorics, going to their space, and then yeah. brings them to power in order to stop socialists and progressives. This is what these elections will be about. And dear friends, we have a very strong manifesto elaborated together. This is not just empty words. This is a working plan for the future of Europe and our people. A Europe which is free, democratic, which is fair, which is solidar, which is just to the people, which is fighting inequality. And Europe which we believe in and which is progressive. We can win these elections. There are two conditions. We have to be united, but united on the basis of our values and principles and be coherent. And then we have to talk to people, to persuade them. We can do it together. So let's do it. 
starting from today. Thank you very much.